Coletta and Tyson Nurseries are one of Europe's largest specialist growers of ornamental plants. With a capacity to handle over 2 million plants a day, they currently grow over 100 million ornamental plants each year at their site, which covers over 400 acres. In recent years, they've invested into world-leading automation technology and wanted to take their next step into the future. So when John called and asked if our XAG drones could apply their springtime application of Q4 shading agent to their greenhouses, it sounded like an interesting challenge. When we arrived on site, we mapped out the first greenhouse for shading, filled up the drone's 20 litre tanks and set it going. After a couple of trial runs, we soon settled on a spray spec that gave us a good even coating. We were using a one to nine mix of Q4 shading agent applied at 600 litres per hectare with a droplet size of 285 microns with a flight speed of four kilometres per hour at two metres above the glass. This one hectare greenhouse would use 600 litres of mixed agent and take about an hour to cover. So with a 20 litre tank, we'd need to refill 30 times, which keeps the ground crew on their toes, but at least they're not balancing in the gutter of a glass roof. When the tank runs out, the drone automatically heads back to its takeoff point for a quick tank swap, then it's straight back to work. In between tank fill-ups, we did some quick calculations. The drone will get the job done in a quarter of the time it usually takes and will use less than half the amount of Q4 shading agent. And that's before you take into account the huge health and safety benefits of keeping everybody's feet on the ground. So was this trial a success? Well, it showed that shading with a drone was safer, faster and cheaper. And that counts as a big win in my book. Thanks, XAG.